Day Watchers. Today's episode is about uh, another watch from a micro brand named, uh, named uh, Zelos. By the way, please follow and support my channel. Just one click on the subscribe button below. So this is the Swordfish. It's uh, the Titanium Sun model. It got the box and it is a gold stamp with the Zelos logo and looks like uh, the box is uh, made of wood that's uh, why it is so heavy this actually looks like a quality made but uh, for the price point of uh, $400 you should at least uh, make the packaging very nice I guess they forego the usual watch box uh, instead they just put the watch inside this nice leather watch pouch I think this is a traveling pouch for watches and it is a nicely done pouch it looks actually expensive it's made of leather and there as you can see they have the stamp their branding on it and yep surprise surprise it came with an extra uh, leather strap with another stamping of their own branding and it looks quality too so it's really nice and we've got the watch over here and here it is this is the swordfish even with this type of packaging, I can say that uh, the watch is well protected. The case is 42mm, made of titanium, making this a lightweight diving watch at around 150 grams, including the titanium bracelet. Lug to lug is 48mm, a very easy to manage leg for most uh, wrist sizes. Thickness is 13 mm, a little bit on the thick side, but it is manageable because of uh, that angular lugs pointing down. Lug width is 22 mm, pretty standard size, very easy to find aftermarket leather or leather straps. Here it is on my 16.5 cm wrist. Thus, the ride's a little bit high, but it is manageable. A scratch resistant sapphire crystal with the inner AR coating for that uh, added clarity. Case is satin finish, although I can see a little hint of brushing on the side and unusually done vertically. The lines on the case are very distinguished and some of the chamfered parts are polished. A 120 click unidirectional bezel. The grip is widely spaced in two tone, satin and sunblasted on the inside part. I have to say that is uh, very well executed. Bezel insert also in titanium, pulley loom, which I will get into later. Bracelet is three column, also made of titanium. Links are smaller than the usual oyster bracelet, which is very flexible and thus making it more comfortable. We have screw links for easier adjustment to your wrist. The threefold clasp is stainless steel and this is where the additional weight comes from. We have a single locking push down on the sides. Micro adjustment is also a different innovation, similar to those from Seiko's mid to high range watches. 
you can pull this tab and then pull the bracelet out to loosen it and uh, you can just uh, easily push it back to tighten it and I love the branding on the clasp you have that brush finish on the side and in the center that sunblasted finish that gives it a touch of contrast and the Zillow's logo on the center beautifully done and it is at par with the sum of the watches that I actually have changing straps is also a breeze with this one you just push these two knobs inwards and you will be able to change uh, to your desired straps I was actually able to do this in, this in less than a minute the case back is also titanium with that two-tone finish similar to the clasp the swordfish image is legibly done with sharp details and contrast the coin edge crown is also signed it is screwed on for that added protection of its 100 meter water resistance the case is also extended to give protection to the crown the dial is one that pulled me to this model of the swordfish Celos called this the black sun the texture on it is so fine evenly spread out it is hard to see in imperfections and it is in black thus the name black sun really really stunning we have the zealous branding at 12 o'clock an additional text at the 3 o'clock position above where they put the date window the date window is just a square cutout where you can see the black date wheel a departure from the usual 3 o'clock date wheels instead of uh, applied indices the ones here are, are cutouts from the dial showing the creamy light brown colors that matches the color scheme of the whole look of this watch the cutouts on the 3, 6, 9 and 12 o'clock have a fine white line on the edges giving a little boost of uh, contrast for visibility the gilded hands have that beveled edges which gives different light angles when viewed again the loom matches the color scheme of the watch the second hand is perfectly done where the loom is on the end and ended with the red tip it is just stunning I love the design of it the chapter ring is done in white with black minute markers also fully loom and speaking of the loom this is one of the reasons that attracted me to buy this watch so let's uh, get my blue thingy and blast it so the loom is a combination of the C3 X1 these are the green ones and the BGW9 the blue parts as you can see this uh, also like a two-tone loom so this is definitely a watch for those uh, loom lovers out there in conclusion the Celos Swordfish Titanium 42mm Black Sun is an exciting diving watch that would suit any occasion just by changing the bracelet or strap and Zelos is renowned for making watches with incredible value for money and impressive build quality this is not an, an sponsored video I bought this watch and everything here are my, are my impressions and opinions all in all Zelos has created a stunning watch at this price point and the build quality which I am very impressed I would highly recommend this watch this is a lovely companion for your wrist for all your adventures be it at the office or in the ocean so thank you for watching and please uh, don't forget to subscribe